to the roots today. Now, first, we're in the new house. Look, it is a complete wreck, because we just got a truck uh, with all of my stuff from London. Look, even Wolfgang, who was in London, in the flat in London. So, also, by the way, if you want to see a tour of the house, it's on my French vlog channel. Um, so I'll put a link down below. But anyway, it's a complete wreck. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna leave. All right, good luck. Enjoy. The weapon of choice for today is the Renault Twizy, which I believe to be the perfect spotting car because you can lean out the window to film with someone in the back. It's electric. You can park wherever you want. It's, it's perfection. And now that our house is right in the center, literally drive out of the house, Casino Square. Yeah. Remember my old intro from like 2012 back in the car spotting days? We're like www.sendlady.com. It wasn't even a website back then. Can we let's, let's put a clip of it? The first stop. Oh, nice Porsche. The first stop is always Casino Square when your car's running, which they've actually redone. It looks quite cool. G63 by Turbo. Uh, Brabus, my tub was 700, very cool. Porsche, Porsche, 993, very nice. New Casino Square, very pretty. Look, look, classic Porsche, 720S, Spider. AMG GT, 488, Spider. Very, very nice. Check Casino Square, the new Casino Square, it's very pretty. Second stop, Fairmont on the famous, uh, well, Fairmont corner, they call it the Lowe's Hairpin. We're gonna pretend like we're going in. They've opened the Nikki Beach which is a bar here, so often there may be a few cars. We'll pretend like we're going in, but we're just driving around. Ooh. NSX, they're pretty rare actually, you don't see many of those. Cipriani, good restaurant there, that can be a good spot, but it's closed. Let's go to all the car dealerships. That's where you often see some pretty, pretty cool stuff. Post-corona car spotting, not ideal. Monte Carlo Bay Hotel, there may be a couple of things. Bentley Bentayga, yeah, very nice. Beach club, it's not that good weather today. Bentley, continental. So there might not be that much stuff, let's see. Car spotting needs patience. Okay, even though it's a, it's a pretty massive fail right now, we will find something tasty at some point. Let's go to the dealerships, you never know. You need patience, you wait around. I guess worst case, we've showed at least where you can car spot. Right, so usually, you would have a couple of things here and there, but today there's absolutely nothing. So we got a McLaren here, 570S, McLaren GT as well. We're not very lucky. So let's keep going to various dealerships. Monaco Yacht Club for BMW i8, G Wagon, Rolls Royce, very nice. J Ferrari, ah, Chobo. White Rolls Royce Ghost, very classy. There's a look in front of us, very, very rare. Mini Cooper, Seb Delaney edition. Now, don't listen to others, because there are rumors that it's sport diesel. Just don't listen to those. Fake rumors, fake news. It's the Seb Delaney edition. So if ever you see one of those, that's, oh look, G-Wagon. That was the Brabus we saw on Casino Square. I think, I believe, right? Oh, very nice. A 35 AMG, a cup of each, the chef more. That's very nice, actually, very cool spec. I like. I really like grey cars at the moment. I just thought I'd share that with you. Pass me the camera. We're just gonna get out to check out a couple of cars at a car dealership here um, to see what they've got because apparently they've got some cool cars and they're clearly not having much luck on the streets. Right, I didn't know they had this. This was a good decision coming here. I've never seen one of these before. Porsche 935. I mean, this is a beast. Track only, this spec is epic. So, okay, I'm gonna walk through first impressions. This Coke spec is awesome. So huge, really thick carbon weave here. Look, gloss carbon there. And what do we have? We've got matte carbon fiber here. But again, really big weave. Matte carbon there, but much smaller weave. Presumably this is the fuel filler cap there. They've moved it. This is based on a GT2 RS, I believe, but loosely. I think they kind of sacked everything off. Tracker only, not on slicks. Massive Michelin tires. Look at that center lock, wow. The size of this wing mirror. Look at that. I put my head next to it. It's huge. That's gloss carbon, plexiglass windows, full race spec interior. You've still got the 911 doors, you can recognize those, but it's so wide. And then look how long it is. They've really extended the rear. This is not a wing, it's a table. These have to be the coolest exhaust tips I've ever seen. 
Yeah. Absolutely insane. And then look at that. Full, so matte carbon fiber weave here, gloss carbon there. You can still see the 911 lights though. 901.2 lights. Well, I guess there is an upside. Good thing we stopped here. What else is there? There's a 570S. Nice spec. Carbon front bumper. Not too many have those. Oh, it's a GT. It's not, yeah, that's right. It's a GT. So you've got a bit of storage space behind here. I actually think the GT's lines are maybe slightly prettier. I love these. I really, really love these. 458 Spider. This is probably one dream car. Dream car for down here. Really nice spec. Sports seats. Carbon. New R6 as well. I like the little blue detailing on the front headlights there. Awesome. And then an Audi e-tron. Very nice. Right, shall we continue? Right. They've opened the car for us, which is lovely. First of all, this is literally the weight of a sheet of paper, this door. And then you've got this awesome steering wheel. So brand new. This is a nice touch, the wooden, um, how do you call that? Gear lever, there you go. Awesome, awesome interior. These seats, proper, this is a, I mean, full blown race car. Only 77 of them being made apparently. Look at that dashboard as well, that's very cool. They very kindly let us in here, DPM uh, down here. Awesome, awesome dealership. Now it let me in this 935, which is obviously, yeah, quite a beast. And actually show me how we, no, well we can't start the car, but we can show you the dashboard. So you've got the kill switch here, which you just, bang that goes on it kind of comes to life it's really even stopped like this it's quite an intimidating beast and then you put the key in turn the key to put the ignition on and the dashboard comes to life so you've got your shifter lights up here your oil temperature pressure water water temperature your fuel used your brake bias rear and front which you can adjust lap times time different between your laps i mean what an animal your pit speed right here I mean, I'm not sure what some of these buttons do, but yeah, it feels special. Well, what's cool is you can kind of recognize that 911-ness in it, in the shape of the dash, in these air vents up here. You still got, actually, you still got um, uh, air conditioning in this car. So if you're on track, you can still have that, which is pretty cool. All your buttons are pretty big and accessible um, so that you can press them when you're going around track. One cool little thing as well is, look, I go cool here. You can take the steering wheel out. So we were saying, you know, often if you go to a cafe, you just put the key on the table. Here, you can just show up and put this on the table. We didn't want to film too much because the police were there. There was a Liberty Walk Hurricane, four wheel drive, 610. Yeah, that was pretty cool. Pretty red. At first I thought it was a Perf, but then I saw Liberty Walk. Had some really nice rims on it. That, that's our best spot so far today. Beautiful Fonvier port. Ceramic brakes on an S63, V8 by turbo. You don't see many of these because it's a proper, proper luxury car. Ceramic brakes, that's awesome. Anyways, and then a 992 Carrera, convertible. These are growing on me so, I mean, I've always liked them, but now I love them. And another, this time a Carrera 4S. Harder to tell now if it's a 2S or a 4S because on the new ones, they don't, they're not any wider, the four wheel drive ones. They're always wide, even on two wheel drive. Fun fact. Sometimes at the Ferrari garage you see a few things. A few nice Ferraris. That car that is really nice. My car is actually in there somewhere. Ferrari Portofino. Oh. GGT. Very nice. It's pretty tiring. So we're home now. Hello. And I've got a little bit of food. Straight away. You exhausted? Yeah, really exhausting. We did cheat a little bit with the Twizy, but we saw some cool stuff, 935. Uh, yeah, some pretty cool things actually, that Hurricane as well. Anywho, on that jolly note, I'm going to say goodbye bye to you guys. Hope you enjoyed the video, subscribe if you aren't already, and I'll see you very soon. Cheers. Mm.